Hello again. It's been so long since I put up another video, but here goes nothing. So bear with me during this video. My husband is building an entertainment center, so he has the saw going in the background. Sorry about that. And my dogs are shaking their collars, and my son is playing the piano, so it's very loud, and I'm sorry. But this is all I can do. I need to get this video up. It's been so long. Alright, so for this one I decided to do an A-frame tent. It's pretty cool and pretty simple to make. Alright, so let's get started. And don't forget to click on the link in the description box below to go to her original blog post. First things you're going to need is four 1 inch by 2 inch by 48 inch white wood molding, one 3 4 inch by 48 inch poplar dowel, I think I'm saying that right. A drill with a 3 4 spade bit. Some scissors. You will also need some coordinating thread, some elastic. You will also need some fabric that will cover your frame. Approximately 44 inches by 83 and a half inches and that is hemmed. Alright, so to get started you're going to take your four little moldings. You're going to measure 6 inches down and then you're going to mark it straight in the middle of the molding just as I did here. And then you're going to figure out a way to uh, make a hole in the middle of your molding. It is very similar to that. I did mine on my kitchen counter and then later I actually went outside and did them on our stairs. Once you get your fabric, you're going to make a hem around the entire thing. However hem you want, I, I think I do a half inch hem. I'm not exactly sure on the hem I do, but you just do a hem around the entire fabric. And then you're going to take your elastic and you're going to cut your elastic into four five inch strips. And then you're going to loop them and put them on each corner. Now what I did is I laid my fabric over the whole frame first and then I measured or I figured out exactly how I wanted the elastic to hook on the bottom. I don't think she actually explained that in her blog so I just kind of threw it over and then figured out exactly how I wanted it to measure up there. But once you get that done, you're going to sew that on and then to put it onto your A-frame tent, you're going to just hook them up like so and then throw your fabric over it and then let your little one enjoy. Now with ours, I would say that this was a fail to begin with. We had to actually take a screw and screw it in each um, side so that it, the dowel or the, the moldings will not slip because they were slipping on our hardwood floor and they were not sturdy enough for him to crawl through and do whatever he wants. So I would consider this a fail to begin with. But in the end, it turned out to be a win after we actually did some remodeling to it I guess you could say but um, I still think it's a little flimsy we actually keep it on the carpet to um, hold its durability a little better but that is it so hope you enjoy all right thanks for watching this video hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and thanks bye bye